Yes. Oh, yours does go over there, Ida. That's only to take it through the needle, that you don't have to battle to get it through the needle. Here and there, there's... Because it's the bottom, the top tension. I'm a person that, if, I, if there's something that you can do by hand, I like to learn and do it. So if I can get it right, then I feel I've achieved something. So, yes, it's, I like that. I like to be able to say, well, I can quilt, I can make jewellery, and all other kinds of crafts. After a while I started with embroidery, that's also part painting and needlework. I call it needle painting. My name is Gail Lindstrom. I'm originally from South Africa, but the last five years we've uh, resided in UAE. To me it was a shock, but I think to my husband it was a bigger shock because he thought we wouldn't get through it. But yes, it's, it's part of my life now. But I don't think of it. I don't think of being a sick person. And what I can do, I do. I do a lot of needlework and crafts and everything and they keep me busy and they keep my mind busy. Maybe some days it feels like I need to take the full tablet. In this way, I'm sure I take my medication every day. But some days, if you're too busy, you, can, you know you're a sick person. <laughs> then you have to go take two or three days off to recuperate again so that you can go on again. In our family, Julius's aunt, she yeah, also uh, had breast cancer, and that was after I had mine. And she was very negative. Life doesn't stop here when you have breast cancer. They've got so many cures, and people that have recovered completely of breast cancer. And yeah, she just she just gave in. She was so negative. She um, couldn't even do her chemo. She just decided she doesn't want to live anymore. I've still got so much to live for. I mean, I've got five grandchildren and I've got so many needlework. I still want to make a quilt for each one of them. If you're yes. negative and you don't want to live, the cancer just takes you. And you can't go and sit down and say I'm a sick person and do nothing. There are enough sick days to do that. So the days you feel better, you really must do something with your life. <laughs>